you touch down on Earth, you think you're home because you've been in space for however long. The reality is, in this circumstance, that you're going to splash down in the ocean, hopefully off the coast of California, near a recovery ship. The complications and how difficult it really is to recover a capsule from the ocean, safely get the crew out of the capsule and on board the vessel, and some medical attention as necessary, is, uh, is a lot more complicated than I think people would really understand without thinking about it. And that's why we're out here testing, because we want to be able to do that as efficiently and safely as possible. The, the Apollo astronauts, they would get out, divers come in, they'd get the rafts inflated around it, they bring in a helicopter, the helicopter take the crew away, another helicopter come and take the capsule out. This capsule is significantly heavier. It's uh, 20,000 pounds minimum, 30,000 is what they have to plan for. If you throw in a factor of safety, there's no helicopter in the world that's going to pick up that capsule. It's built to take four people to Mars, so it's not like it's a tiny thing. So it's significantly different, and the mission is significantly different than Apollo. You know, the longest mission there was like 16 days or something, whereas we're talking years. So the LPD is a fantastic platform for this because it has the well deck, which allows you to bring the capsule inside. It has tremendous medical facilities, so they can handle almost any condition that the crew members will be in when they get out of the capsule. And if they need to leave, there's a helicopter deck as well. Well, I think the ship and the crew are doing a great job. The crew's been very resilient. Uh, it's just one more tasking that they've had to tackle in a very busy schedule as we prepare for deployment. Uh, but uh, everybody has stepped up and uh, absolutely provided, I think, the best support uh, that could have been expected. Recovery of the capsule is very similar to recovering or uh, emergency recovery of a LCAC, a landing craft air cushion, uh, where we winch it into the well if it's unable to make it on its own. It's also very close in similarity to LCU operations, landing craft utility, uh, where we have multiple lines along the wing wells that assist uh, bringing the craft into the well uh, to, to secure it. Well, I think uh, with all the training and planning that's been involved, it's going about as expected. The weather's been very cooperative, and the weather's probably the single biggest component that can make the recovery of the capsule a more challenging evolution.